Hello YouTube, this is Trigoli from Nights in the Never, and I'm bringing some Crisis 2 gameplay here, some old Crisis 2 gameplay I had laying on my hard drive. Uh, it's, I don't have the best score, I believe it's 16 and 6 in the end, but it was still pretty fun. And I'm using the Scar with a Reflex Sight and Extended Max, my singer is the Hammer uh, Pistol, and my modules are Threat Tracker, Cloak Tracker, and Aim Enhance. And if you don't know what they do, Threat Tracker basically make me able to see enemy bullets being fired towards me. Cloak Tracker, I can see where a guy went into cloak. Like an enemy, I can see that at that specific spot he went into cloak. And Aim Enhance basically makes me my gun have less recoil when I aim down the iron sights. So for this commentary, I wanted I wanted to do something a bit different. And the reason is because right now, as I'm recording this commentary, I have my school exams coming up my like my final exams i had one um yesterday and that actually went pretty well i got the high <laughs> i got the highest grade there so i'm very happy about that but that's not important but the thing is i've been going to this school for over nine maybe ten years and it's not that long ago where i suddenly realized hey i'm not going to be here next year like at that point, I just suddenly realized that I'm not going to go to the school anymore, that now it's done, I'm going to move on to some something else. And, I don't know, it just seems very weird to me suddenly, not every single morning, every day, or every five day of the week, I go up and <laughs> ride my bike to that school. Of course, I'm, st I'm going to go to a different school now, a gym gymnasium, I don't know if that's like high school or something in the US, it depends on where you live, how your school system is, but where I live in Denmark we have normal school which we call Folkeskolen, and then we have, you can go to all different kinds of things, you can like learn about trading, you can learn to be an engineer, you can go directly into learning to be a, I, believe, I think, no, you can't go directly into being a vet or something like that, but you can go and learn to be a, uh, well, what's it called? Like a, a guy who works on walls, who builds houses. You can go directly into those kind of things. And I'm going to another school next year before I'll then move on to, I'm not quite sure yet, I think I might become a vet or maybe a programmer, but I, that's not a, what I want to talk about. I just... It just that uh, I wanted to make this commentary because it feels weird for me because both all of my friends, I probably won't be seeing them that much anymore since we're going to go in different directions. I believe there's like maybe five or so people from my class that's going to the same school as I am next year, but most of them are going someone er somewhere else. And it it's just very weird to me, and it's <laughs> something I hadn't really thought that much about. I mean, school was just going nicely if, a few weeks ago, like it was all normal. But then suddenly, we had to start thinking about our exams. I mean, everything was just leading up to those exams, but I was never really thought about how close we actually were to being done with the school. And it's just weird. <laughs> I've said this so many times doing this commentary already, but it just seems very weird to me how I didn't, I completely lost track of where I was in terms of my school and how far we were in that year i thought it was still like a few months or so left at one point but then there was only one month left or something but it is a bit funny i i don't know what's going to happen next year i hope i get a really good year in the next school because um in this year and this school i've been going to for about nine years it's it has it's had its ups and downs like, the first few, well, the three or four years, I was the one that was always had been teased by all of the uh, people in my class. I was the one that they always looked down on. Then then it went up for a few years, and but then suddenly went down when my best friend had to leave to go somewhere else. So that was, it's had its ups and downs, but I think overall I'm pretty satisfied with it. And to be a bit educational, I've learned a lot of things from there, and I... I think I've found myself really, like, I don't think I would have been, mm, well, I don't know. <laughs> it's I, I don't know that much right now. Uh, but, like, the, the commentary is coming to an end here, so 
Thank you for watching. Remember to check out my Twitter, my uh, Steam group. The link and the name will be in the video description. Also remember to tune in for my live streams every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. I do a live stream. It depends on what I feel like, but mostly I try to keep it at half an hour to at least half an hour. And it's every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday for... Or it starts at 9 p.m. Danish time. So you can just search on Google for time converter. You can easily find an online converter where you can get the time converted to wherever you live so you know exactly when I start live streaming. And also, if you like this type of commentary, then give this a, th give this a th thumbs up. Give this a thumbs up if you want to see more of these kind of commentaries. So thank you for watching and take care.